In this video, I'm going to quickly walk through how we can monitor traffic from a virtual machine that's actually going between another virtual machine and a different source or target. So typically, if we're using Network Monitor, the first thing we have to do is in Capture Settings, if we want to monitor traffic that's not for this host, it's not the source or the destination, for the adapter it's listening on, you have to turn on Promiscuous Mode or P Mode. So that's the first thing I need to do. But additionally, with the Hyper-V switch, it won't see traffic for other virtual machines anyway. So in this case, I want to capture traffic from my file server. So I'm going to look at my settings. Under the network adapter, advanced, I have to turn on port mirroring. And its mirroring mode is set to source. So this virtual machine will be the source of traffic that will be sent somewhere else as well. It's mirroring it. So my virtual machine that's actually going to run that network monitor utility, I have to set its port mirroring to the destination. So it's not going to be sent a copy of all of the traffic from anyone who is a source. At this point now, I can start the mirroring. And the first thing I want to do is I start seeing a lot of traffic straight away. So I might want to load a particular filter. I shall look at my history. I just want to see SMB2 and SMB3 traffic. SMB2 includes SMB3. And I can see various types going over here. And what I want to show is on my file server, I actually have a text file. And I'm going to load that from my local machine. So I'm going to double click on that. And I can see the content of that file. I'm going to close it. And what I now want to do is in that network monitor, I want to show that traffic was captured. So I'm going to stop it. And I could manually search through here. Or I can say the contains Savile text. I'm going to apply that filter. It's searching. And then it found that packet from source 35, so my workstation, going to 15. And sure enough, in the body, there's that text. And just to prove, if I look at this machine, this is dot 10. So it now on a Hyper-V switch captured traffic for another VM by using the mirroring and setting this to promiscuous mode. And that was it. Hope this was useful. Thank you.